Well, just when you thought every kind of poker game has been thought of, along comes multi-entry tournaments now available at Full Tilt Poker. Man, you gotta hand it to Full Tilt Poker because they seem to be leading the way in being creative and just introducing new games and variation. And to me, that's just growing their database. That's one of the things that Poker Stars seems to be lacking behind. Not saying one is better than the other, but to me, Full Tilt is definitely more creative. So let's clarify what these multi entry tournaments are. They are not rebuys. These selected tournaments allow you to enter numerous times and play simultaneously right from the start of each tournament. Each entry costs the same and starts with the same chip stack. Now, these tournaments are marked in the lobby, this little thingy here, and when you proceed to the register process of one of these tournaments, the buy-in drop-down shows you how many multi-table entries are allowed. I assume there may be different buy-in limits for each tournament. But while we're going through this, we'll actually look at a real multi-entry tournament registering right now. Um, well, here's, let's see, let's see, tournaments, all, oh, here's one, $600, okay, that's not mine. I wonder if rush tournaments will have multi-entries, that could be interesting. Okay, here's one, it's a $2 double stack MTT, okay. Let's see, this one is allowing for four entries to start. That's cool. Now, as you can see, some players have already registered four times for this tournament. Actually, look at this. Most players have actually registered multiple entries. So, during a tournament, you can check how all of your entries are doing at any given time. And, of course, the software will have all of your entries at different tables. So you may be asking yourself, what happens if you have multiple entries that go deep into a poker tournament? Well, realistically, that ain't going to happen. But if it does, the Full Tilt software will not allow you to play more entries than there are tables left in the tournament. So as your table is breaking up and, you know, you have another entry on another table or the only other choice is another table with you on it, your stacks are going to be combined or merged. This in itself could be an interesting development because your remaining stack could go from let's say orange M zone to like yellow or green after a merge and the table dynamics will instantly be better for you so let's talk about some implications of this feature firstly bigger prize pools and you know what that's what full tilt wants especially in the lower limits I also feel this inspires weaker players to play even more like the fools they already are. They may get to a point where they don't really care about one entry because they're doing so well with another one. They might have this sort of might as well go for it attitude. And if you're at that table, then you may be able to take advantage of their loose mistakes. They're just going to be more players like that. This in turn to me means more bottom line profit for players who can make solid decisions over and over again. This is why I love these Full Tilt creations. They just inspire true nonsense at the poker table. Another good thing is if you only like playing these $2 tournaments and there's only one running and you want to play more and you don't have to go to another site. You can just take your $2 entry, go in the tournament two, three, four times. You know, you're playing your, with your prescribed bankroll limit and you're not extending yourself. Very cool again. It's like it's increasing your chances of winning tournament prize money by staking other players, but you're not sure if you can trust those other players. Well, now you can because those other players are actually you playing with your money. I can also see the prize pool ballooning in some of these tournaments, somewhat like the prize pool changed in with these on-demand tournaments that Full Tilt introduced a few weeks ago. Now, here is the bestest best ever reason to play multi-tournaments. Revenge. revenge. When I say revenge, let's say a full tilt fucking moron calls down your ace-king suited all the way and hits two pair on the river with his ace-three offsuit and eliminates your sorry ass. Aha. Uh -huh. Oh my god, you have a chance to not only still nail that wanker, but take back all the chips he won from you. <laughs> Oh 
Oh my god, I want to do that so bad. <laughs>